I cannot believe this. I literally cannot believe this. Is this real? I imagine there's probably gonna be some spoilers a little bit on this stream, probably. Um, just throwing it out there because I think this DLC takes place at the, right before the final mission. Um, I think I load up my last save and then immediately we go off and do something else, which is wild. I think that's what it is. Could be wrong, but I think that's what it is, but so, Oh, I can't even speak. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Um, just know that I'm going to I'm gonna probably talk about spoilers, okay? So, yeah. Just throwing it out there. You guys probably already know that. Echoes of the Fallen. Is something the matter, Karen? You seem perturbed. Do I know? How clever of you to notice. But yes... Some has come to my attention. And I'll We're gonna send you on a crazy Leviathan somewhere. I think the next DLC might be like Leviathan. Um, go on. Go on. Go on. It's probably quicker if I just show you. Here. Some sort of crystal. The hell? Though, I don't remember seeing one that color before. Aye, well, that makes two of us. In all my long years of trading, both over and under the counter, I've never seen anything quite like it. They're calling them dusk crystals. Dusk crystals. On account of colour. Okay. I see. And they can be used to cast magics. That they can. Just like their brighter, shinier cousins. Difference is, they don't last as long. After a couple of goes light in your pie, they crumble away to nothing. Chad, don't say dark That's ether. That's how I heard about them. <laughs> From crystal traders moaning that someone's been flooding the market with dodgy goods. And after asking the right people the right questions and paying the right price, of course, I managed to get my hands on a sample. What does this mean? Hmm. I see why you're perturbed. I hope. Do you feel that, Clive? Yes. Guys, what? God, I, I can't believe we're watching more cutscenes from this game. Meanwhile. Do they have active time lore for this too? Oh, they do! They do! Entries for Echoes of the Fallen will now appear in active time lore. If you don't recognize a term or wish to know about events currently unfolding, I... Oh my god, this game. I'm so glad they have this again. This is in the Imperial Province of Rosaria. Huh. All right, lads, that'll do for today. Who is this? I said that'll do for today. They're yes, mining. Chief. They're playing. Yes, Chief. Chief? Let's get this lot back to town, fill our purses, and then our bellies. All right. What did you two do now? <laughs> Dude, what? Please tell us you bought another London. Stay calm, both of you. Who is this? Who needs a lantern when you've got one of these?
but it goes away quick, right? That's, that's what they said. Oh, yep. <laughs> All that work for a single spark. Well, there'll be no more sampling the merchandise today. That sounded close, Chief. Really close. Really, really close. Now, lads, what am I <laughs> always telling you? Good things come. Oh, they're to so those dead. Those who run. <laughs> Wait for us, Chief. <laughs> He got the hell out of there. Is this the apothecary? What the? There's an Omega symbol in Echoes. Oh my lord. Oh my god. Dude, I'm hyped. What is happening? Oh my god. I've never felt a tremor this far inland before. Me neither. But then I'd never seen skies like these till a few moons ago, and it's been all change ever the since. Purple sky. Come to think of it, the first anyone ever heard of these dust crystals was after you lot came back from the Dominion and brought this bloody weather with you. Do you think the two things are connected? Who knows? Could just be that with Drake's tail gone, the black market was running short of the good stuff. The Dominion's mines were the only source of new shards left in storm after a certain evil outlaw decided <laughs> to do away with the other mothers. Spoilers. And with the price of decent crystals going through the roof, traders turned to dealing in stuff they'd never have touched before. The question is, who's selling these crystals and where are they? Wait. This color. What? They couldn't be from origin, could they? No, that wouldn't make sense. I saw it form in the sky, and that was long after we returned from the Dominion. But if they didn't come from origin or any of the other mother crystals, then. Does that mean. That you missed one? Aye. Oh, yeah. That were my thinking, any road. Another mother crystal we didn't know Oh about. my god. I'll speak with Joshua. <laughs> what the hell is If happening? you're right about this, we need to find it. Is it underground? I'm quick, I'd say. On account of which, I'll take this shot over to Tomes for you. Get I wonder, to I wonder it if it's like, over, it's just like underground, completely belt. hidden, and you go deeper right. and deeper into the Thank world. You. You and know? I expect you'll be wanting Jill's help with this. Yes, too. please. Yes, please. Right again. I will. I'll take Jill. Let me go and find Joshua. I'll take Joshua. I would like Dion to be here too. Can I take Dion? Hey yo, new quest accepted song? A crystal darkly. Brave the dusk. Chasing the echoes. Quest destinations for Echoes of the Fallen are indicated with a purple sigil. After accepting the quest, current objectives are displayed on the to-do list on the right hand side of the screen. These will temporarily replace main scenario objectives. It says, speak with Joshua, if you wish to restore main scenario objectives to the to-do list, you can do so in the journal tab in the main menu. Cool. I mean, it just goes into your thing, and it's it's clearly marked as a different thing. Clearly. Which is awesome. Oh, my God. This is just wild. Joshua, we need to talk. Karen's caught wind of something that I don't think we can afford to ignore. I literally miss all of them so much. I'm so happy we're playing this. Put the cloud sword, dude. Buster sword. Aye. That is troubling. Not least because the Undying made no mention of these dusk crystals in any of their recent reports. So they weren't aware of them either. I wonder when they worked on this DLC, Jess. Or perhaps they merely deemed them unworthy of my attention. Uh, wrongly, I might add, for I am inclined to share Lady Karen's misgivings. Then we'd better take her advice and consult Hippocrates forthwith. To the shelves, then. With our combined insight, I'm sure we'll discern something of use, be it no more than a place to start. Let's hope so. We get to speak with the lad as well.
there you are. I've taken the liberty of Chill. telling these two everything I told you. Aww. Thank you, Karen. It's hard to believe such a lusterless shard could conjure much of anything. And you truly think this came from a mother crystal? One we never knew existed? Every other shard in the twins did. Why should these dusk crystals be any different? Dim though they may be. We know they first appeared on the black market shortly after Ultima Kar's primogenesis, darkening Maybe the skies. It awakened something so in the ground. So the two be connected? Could the spell have created a new mother crystal, perhaps? A replacement for the ones we destroyed? What do you think, Hippocrates? I think there may well be a connection. Yet, if we are to believe that the original mother crystals were of Ultima's making, does it seem likely that he would have need of anything so palpably inferior? No. I hazard that it was not Ultima who created these crystals, but humanity. Excuse me? More specifically, our fallen forebears, whose wonders litter the land even What? Now. Legend holds that the fallen challenged the gods in order to win their power and came tantalizingly close to doing so. Sorry, but are we actually learning about the fallen? I mean, I guess so. If, it's, if this DLC is called Echoes of the Fallen, we're finally learning about the fallen. Like, that was such a big question mark still for me. It was like, we still didn't understand everything about that civilization. It seems only reasonable that they should wish to learn the secrets of the crystals which the gods bestowed upon them. So they could make their own. They could make their Precisely. own. Precisely. You may recall that the tale of the sins of Zemeckis begins with the colloquy of the sages, a council wherein humanity sought to uncover the last secrets of the gods before waging their war to learn what little remained. It is perfectly possible that an understanding of how to craft crystals was among their many achievements. So it's like, among their many achievements prior to their fall. It's like in Sonic Adventure 2 when Tails made a fake emerald and tricked Eggman, but then also didn't. And it's like, it has the same wavelength and properties as the real emerald. You can be, you might be able to use Chaos Control if you figure it out. And we kind of just like move past that as a community that Tails made a Chaos Emerald. But it's literally like that. So the fallen are just a bunch of foxes. That's my indeed. The same Yes, was right. I, I kept the titles. Forged great and terrible weapons called the iconoclasts, from what which the icons derived their name, and turned them against each other in the Magitech War. A pointless conflict which served only to make its victors more confident of their right to supplant the gods on high. What did you just say to me? Magitech, a term that appears in the early histories of the fallen civilization and describes their highly advanced magical technology, which the airship is the best known example. They also produce weapons all but indistinguishable. They also produce weapons all but indistinguishable from living beings, yet whose destructive power rivaled out of the gods of legend. The early chronicler, chroniclers labeled these beasts the iconoclasts, and it is from this term that the icons of the present day take their moniker. Yeah, have we ever seen the word Magitech in this game? I don't think we have. And when at last they ventured to do so, the resultant imbalance in the ether is said to have been so great that the skies themselves turned black and began to boil. The first recorded RK sky, I suspect. Which brings us back to the matter at hand. It is my belief that these shards are the product of a long slumbering Magitech mother crystal stirred to life by a similar etheric upheaval to the one which accompanied its creator's fall. What the f- There's only one way to know for sure. It's like a mechanical mother crystal. An artificial Karen, mother crystal. Where did you buy this one? Down in Port is older when I was scratching around for supplies. Since the Imperials buggered off and took the tariffs with him, you can find all sorts of interesting We're getting stuff into like the, the science versus faith Go stuff. Go chat with the mercenaries you know? guarding the gaze. Your uncle's got some good lads there. It's like, oh, you know when to all these like powerful godlike mother crystals, the and then there's this one, one that's made by like science and the stuff. Crystal with you. Might be your key to the underworld. Thank you. I will. We're definitely going in the ground. Shall we then? 100% we're going into I'm different. coming too. If there is another mother crystal out there and it's anything like the others, you'll need all the help you can get. 
I was hoping you'd say that. One more time then. Together. <laughs> My heart. My heart. Cutscene time. Dude, the cutscenes are gorgeous once again, chat. Mommy, oh, slow down. Oh, is that the guy who's running from earlier? <laughs> <laughs> He's still running. <laughs> <laughs> what? That was kind of cool. Fuck me. <laughs> They're fast on their feet. What's going on here, I wonder? What indeed? Let's ask. I love them. I love them. I love them. You've reached a pivotal moment in Echoes of the Fallen. If you continue, you will not be able to return. Proceed. Um... Excuse me. Who were those men just now? Bloody troublemakers, that's who. As soon as I asked them to present their packs for inspection, they turned white as a sheet and lead did. I chased them all the way from the gates, but they're swift as hares. Still, at least we kept the bastards out. Don't need their kind stirring up any more strife. And what manner of strife have they been stirring up, exactly? Hey, Are you joking? This business with the crystals. Sorry, we've been away for a while. <laughs> What's been going on? Yeah, it's been a right. while. I'll humor you. After the paltry rations the Imperials left behind dried up, folks started trading crystals out in the open. We turned a blind eye at first. Lord Byron's orders. Byron! We well, saw it and went right to deny people the one thing they were all clamoring for. Till the dust started turning up, that is. Dusk crystals, they're called. Ill-favored shards that crack as soon as you look at them. Not that the folk who bought them by the bucket load knew that. And they were baying for blood when they found out. In the end, his lordship had to step in and ban the blasted things. And we've been searching the pack of every trader who's darkened our gates ever since. I see. And you think the men you were pursuing might have been trading in these dusk crystals? Why, you're in the market for some. Anyway, I wouldn't rule it out. In fact, I put a few gill on it. We might still be able to catch them. We might. Do we run for them? If you are heading up that way, you want to keep your sword handy. It's more than dodgy traders playing the roads these days. I want to fight, man. It's Understood. been a while. There's another one. Still no sign of those traders, though. No. It's, it's, it's the Underminer. It's underground. I just hope we haven't lost them. It's gotta be them. These blimmin' tremors are scaring off all our customers. <laughs> the few that weren't scared off by the skies, you mean? Yeah. Uh, perhaps one of those merchants has seen something. I really... Forgive me. Hold but on. did you happen to see three men in robes pass this way? Chat, I was just gonna say, like... I genuinely, I could literally play this game forever. Like, if they kept adding DLCs to this game, I would, I would like, I would never want anything. Like, I, I, would, I, I don't know how to explain it. I'm just like, in in the theoretical world, every year there's a new DLC for Final Fantasy 16 with some crazy peak boss fight, and I'm just happy. I'm just happy. <laughs> Like, they can just keep on making DLCs, man. I know they're not. They're probably only going to do these two, but still. <laughs> yeah, I've seen them. Huh. Poor bastards. What do you mean? A gang of nasty-looking brutes was on their trail. Mm -hmm. Caught up with them just up the road. Screaming at them, they were. Your crystals are your lives and all that. Only the daft buggers kept their crystals and legged it. In which direction? Out of interest. Up that way. Sorry, I watched your Final Fantasy 16 yesterday because I'm waiting for Persona 5. I continue to spoil myself here a bit now, but oh well. Aw. Oh, well, you don't have to Towards if you don't want to. Docks. You don't have to spoil yourself. If it's help they seek there. This DLC is like right before the end game, so. But perhaps they might find a place to hide. Let's hope so. Appreciate it. You like the reaction. And then we can find them before their pursuers do. Thank you. Ooh. And please, take care on the road. Take care on the road. Uh, Chief? They've found us. 
It's getting so a man can't even catch his fucking breath. <laughs> Who is this guy? Gentlemen. <laughs> a word. Who is he? We understand he's been selling some crisps. And like I told you, thieving mates, you're not fucking getting them. <laughs> So you could take your massive sword and shove it. And we have cloud sword as well. I'm sure I could, but we're not thieves. <laughs> Over here, I can smell the one who shat himself. Um, if you've got a plan, Chief, tell us you've got a plan. Of course I've got a bloody plan. Good things and all that. Good things and all that. Let's start again, shall we? <laughs> Let's you be friends. You say you're interested Let's in the crystal now. trade? Not exactly. In actual fact, we were hoping to talk about this. Is that all? Well, then I know just how to help. If you're after the short shifter, he's over here! What? Are you mad? What? Oh, what an ass. Slippery little pricks. Clinkers on the ground. Quick as you like. Gentlemen, you've got it all wrong. Do we look like merchants? He's the one you want. Just look at what he's got in his hand. What? Him? Wait, I'm not. <sighs> Do let us know if you need any more help. Dude, we just got betrayed, man. They won't get far, Clive. No. But they'll wish they had. <laughs> Slay the enemies, I'll baby. You like a suckly pig and feed you to your fucking dog. Kind of you to think you Just take care of them, you know? Oh, they're getting healed? Who's healing? They're dead. You know, it has been a bit. But Odin still rocks. Odin still absolutely destroys when you get that combo. Holy. Oh, <laughs> persistent bastards, I'll give him that. <laughs> Friends, I knew those louts right. were all matched for you. But of course you did. Right, right, right. Because you know what we're capable of, don't you? Now, you deal in crystal. Dusk crystal. And we want to know where you got it. So you're going to tell us. I'd do Let's anything that man says. for a moment that we are the merchants you're looking for. Why would we tell you where we procure our stock? What kind of shepherd leads a wolf straight to you? Oh. 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 And they're getting worse. Clive, the tower. Well, that's new. What in the world? That's impossible. Yeah, Chief, do you think someone else got into the tower? Quiet, you daft sort. And what would they find there if they did? I, I wouldn't know. Ah. I've never been there. Echoes, maybe? Or fallen rubbish? I really couldn't say. The entrance is sealed tight. No way in. And how would you know that if you've never been there? I, uh... Look, behind you, an Akashic monster! If you think I'm going to fall for another one of your cheap tricks... Oh! Oh, it's real! Clive, trouble. What? Just fought a normal version of this. 
What does this one do with Kashik? Wait, don't you dare! I don't think Martha would appreciate that thing on her doorstep. Probably not. <laughs> Let them run then. I have an idea where they'll be heading anyway. Going towards the tower? This shouldn't take too long. Let's do it. Easy. Like, there's, like, probably no spoils to even get from the enemies, because, like, what do I even need at this point? Like, nothing. <laughs> well, that was ill-timed. <laughs> but at least we know what was chasing the merchants. <sighs> That's twice we've saved them now. Go show them at the tower? I I don't see anyone. I've had enough of bandits and beasts, Chief. Can't we just go home <laughs> and let those thieving pricks march in and take what's ours? What's ours? Oh, no, no, no. You don't mean the Dusk Crystal's eye. Halleck? Malik? I feel like all these guys are gonna die. Thing we do. But the lights, Chief. What about the lights? Ah, uh, first you whine about it being too dark, then you whine about it being too light. Think about how easy it'll be to mine. Dude, he's a he's a Fortnite Lego player. Guys, he just wants to mine. He just wants to load up Fortnite. Be Boba Fett or whatever, and just mine some diamonds, dude. It's all he wants. And you're sure they're bound for the tower? <sighs> when they aren't running away from trouble, they're running towards I it. I still gotta play Lego Fortnite, chat. Do you know anything of the place, Joshua? Alas, not. I have seen it labeled Sage Spire on some maps, but beyond that, the ruins are no different from any other fallen derelict. Another impenetrable relic of the past. Not so impenetrable, apparently. Our friends plainly found a way in. Well, the tower is unquestionably large enough to hide. I know you're the entrances. I'm curious but where. Is it large we'll enough see. to hide what we seek? A mother crystal. It would go some way to explain why the area was among the first in Rosaria to fall to the blight. Then it's settled. We head to East Pool and make our approach from the dim. So I think there could have been a mother crystal here in Rosaria all this time. The wars that could have been avoided. That's so we true. We don't know what's in there, Clive. But whatever it is, there is a good reason it has gone unnoticed for so long. The tower sits atop a jagged ridge. Few have ever had occasion to pick their way through the rocks, even before the blight swallowed them. It's so true, man. Like, they've fought... All these nations have fought over these mother crystals, like, you know like massive weapons of power, right? And the fact that there was one here the whole time, like, man, that could have changed the entire geography of all, I don't know what the right word is. Is it geography? I don't know. Like just of all these lands, like there might be a different, Rosario might have a completely different stance in the world if they knew about it. Oh, good God. I mean, it's so smart for a DLC. Just put stuff under the ground. Like, it was hidden cave. Found it. Someone was in a hurry. Three guesses as to who. Then this must be their way into the tower. There's only one way to find out. I bet there's, I bet there's new music as soon as you go in here. I'm, I'm really excited. <laughs> what the f <laughs> 
Dude, this looks insane. What? That is so pretty. Oh my god. This game. Holy hell, that looks great. It seems somebody's woken this place up. The music? Oh. New music chat. Well, I can tell you who it wasn't. Unauthorized biometrics detected. Someone's here. Initializing security scan. Safety protocols disengaged. Yo, the fallen are talking. I don't think that was someone, Clive. I think it was the tower. Either way, it doesn't sound like we're welcome. Keep your guard up. Look at this. Oh my god. When you listen. Piano. Let's go. <laughs> Intruder alert. Intruder alert. The music. I'm getting like copied city vibes from near Automata. I don't know if you guys are too. Oh, this is awesome. Yo, what is that? Yo, what is this? Well, look who it is. What in the world? New boss chat. Oh my god. That is terrifying. Warning. Warning. <laughs> Core defense systems engaged. Initiating sterilization lockdown. What the hell is it talking about, Joshua? <laughs> oh, what a shot. Nice rack focus. Good things, lads. Good things. Good things. Good. We're good. We're good. Oh no. I thought he was dead. Man, he's cheeky. He's still living. Chief. <gasps> this guy's dead. One of them has to die, right? Hey, over here. I freaking love Clive, man. Look, look at this guy. Iron Manning this guy. He's using an Iron Man. Get friend and get out of this place. Now. Oh my goodness. Dude, I'm so pumped. Let's go. It's called Sigma. <laughs> it's called Sigma. <laughs> well, I think you've made it angry. 
Oh! Oh! Dude, I need to lower my face cam so you guys can see the freaking... Oh my goodness! Big damage, big damage. Oh! Whoa! What the? What the? What the hell, dude? Oh! 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 There's a... Oh! Dude, what? <laughs> oh! Oh! I'm so dead, dude. I'm so dead. How? How'd I live? How'd I live? God, Jesus. Dude, I was so close, chat. Oh my God. He's almost, almost got him, almost got him. Come on! That's it. Let's go! Dude, they gave me the phase two checkpoint, which did help. Oh, dude, that was tough, man. Dude. Security Sentinel 503. Sentinel 503, there's 500 of those? Initiating emergency call relocation protocol. Relocation. If I didn't know better, I'd say that was the heart of a mother crystal. What are you talking about? I knew that fallen thing was no match for you. Allow me to apologize for earlier. That was, uh, ill played. All born of a misunderstanding, though. Can we start again? We don't need your apologies. We need answers. And you're going to give them to us. I uh, suppose you'll be wanting to know about the tower then. Yes, please tell us. As you've probably guessed, this isn't the first time what? we've been here. Fact is, my people have been coming to this place for centuries. Have they now? To these ruins in particular? Aye, well, they uh, talked to us, told us what this lot was all for. And what is it for? Well, believe it or not, the Fallen were actually using this place to make their own, uh, mother crystal. Though, despite years of searching, all we ever found was shards. Then, Harpocrates was right. It would seem that the Fallen did indeed acquire the gods' ability to craft crystals. That's crazy, though. I wouldn't go that far. The shards aren't exactly divine. They're not even what you'd call decent. But they're better than nothing, and nothing is what our people had before we found them. So we've been coming here ever since. But these dust crystals have only recently appeared on the black market. What made you decide to start selling them? The skies. Once they went dark, the crystals started growing back till there were more than you could count. There's way more. And with the mothers all cracked, Anyone with anything that could muster so much as a spark had people queuing up to take their coin. Yes, at a cost to us all. Quality apart, these <coughs> crystals 
are no different from the ones the world has been using since the dawn of time. And it cannot continue. It cannot continue. No. It cannot. While this is clearly none of Ultima's doing, there can be little doubt but that it serves his cause. Then our path is clear. So let's do what must be done. We gotta, we gotta stop Wait, the climate change, man. You lot aren't thinking what I think you're thinking. We're about to kill it. Are you? Oh. This is what we do. I think there's a good chance we are. <laughs> but, uh, what about... What about the tower's defenses? Ah, defenses. That thing you just fought, nah. it won't be the last one. And the further you climb, the worse they'll get. How about we head back to Martha's before <laughs> someone gets hurt, eh? Nah. That is sound advice, which I suggest <laughs> you take. You take that. Before someone gets hurt. Because you guys can say, oh, from zero to zero to 100. What the Any hell? idea what those are? They seem to be containers of some sort. Oh, or perhaps... Cages. Like some sort of twisted menagerie. But why here? Dude, this is giving me like forerunners and flood vibes, man. What in the world, dude? How many of these things are there? Contaminant detected. Releasing subjects Alpha, Two, Epsilon. Sick look. Tower is more than 15 centuries old. 15 centuries? Spire Wolf? Dude, they're coming out of the cages, guys. We're fighting like ancient animals. Oh my lord, this is sick. Level 49, baby. If they build this place to grow crystals, why imprison creatures here? <laughs> dude, dude, I want to freak out so bad. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god. Omnicron. The they built more than one. Though it appears this incarnation can fly. Dude, this is sick. This is sick. You're finished. You're finished, bro. Let's go! Dude, we popped off. We literally popped off, guys. Oh my gosh. Guys. Transferring Sentry Prototype AM2 to Stasis Silo West. I'm getting Horizon vibes. Oh dear God. God? Satan? It's a Don't unicorn. Have to hope those crystals it's sporting are as worthless as the others. <laughs> Ew! Mike Wazowski! Evil Mike. Uh-oh. 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 Run, 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 run. Oh, God. There's enemies on the battlefield, too? Oh! Oh! Okay, we're good. We're good. 
Oh my goodness, dude. That was sick. There it is. It's over. It's over. Let's go. Odin is so good. Odin is so OP, dude. When you get that move off and you just start getting the, the bar up and you just use it. Oh. Neural link lost. Re-establishing connection. Imagine an entire war fought with these things. Kind of true, bestie. Kind of true. The quantity of ether required to animate them all would be unfathomable. <laughs> no wonder they were trying to manufacture their own crystals. Unable to establish connection. Raising threat index. Bro, it looks like the slime from Persona 5. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no, no, no. The, the Hall of Illicit. Now's our chance. Dude, there's no music. Oh god. Unauthorized entry detected. Primary core firewalls activated. Initializing iconoclastic defense system. Omega one. Oh! What the hell is an iconoclastic defense system? I have a feeling we're about to find out. And that we will not like the answer. <laughs> oh my god, it's alive! <laughs> oh, that's so creepy. Hello? Oh my. <laughs> um, the Matrix? The crystal. Is the crystal in it? Yeah, it is. It is. Well, at least we know where it is this <laughs> yeah, time. true, true. <laughs> Quite. And if we want it... <laughs> if we want it... All we have to do is kill an icon. Let's freaking go, chat! Safety routines disabled. Weapons armed. Stand clear. Okay. We have standard music. Oh my lord. Um, uh, what? Um, um, uh. Okay. Okay. Dude, this is so sick. Whoa. It's like a mechanical spider. Whoa, whoa. Okay. So far, so good. Move, move. Ignition, go. Uh oh. Might get hit by that, that's okay. What does that do? What is what does that do? Block. Okay, I think it like spawns those triangles, maybe? Maybe it spawns them where I am. We're doing okay. We're doing okay. Oh my god, that attack gets me every time. Hello? Oh, are you about to move? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> what does that do? I don't know what that does. Oh, it's that. The triangles. And the triangles spawn, and then we're good. We're okay. I got the timing down. You're done. There's some damage, chat. There you go. We love Odin. We love Odin. Thank you, Odin. Oh! 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 Dude, Clive's so freaking strong, dude. Oh my god. Oh, that felt good. 
Huge damage. Go. Oh my god, he is a tank though. You're not wrong, chat. close to him. I need, like, a closer, but I don't have one. <laughs> um. Oh, God. Oh. Alright, he's gonna shoot. I know what you're gonna shoot. Oh, wait. Maybe not. Um. Okay. Let's get Odin back. Let's get Odin back ASAP. Oh! Go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> it said. <laughs> what the hell is going on? Music up, okay. Not yet. And what makes you say that? Oh! Let's go, Tortle! The music! This game. This game. Right. I'm convinced. Oh! oh. <laughs> this game is crazy, dude. The music. Holy! <laughs> Bro. What the? Get parried! Get evaded! Dude, this is great. I'm standing up. I'm literally standing up. Oh my god. The music sounds like Final Fantasy 14. The hell? Go! Bro, oh, this is... This is... Come on. Come on. Dude, this is nuts! I just want to listen to the music. What the hell? I'm scared! Guys! <laughs> nice try. This might be- oh. oh! Dude, we're popping off, we're popping off! No! 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 Odin? I don't know if it's gonna hit. It hit, it hit, it hit. We'll take it. Nice try. <laughs> 
This is crazy, bro. Oh my god, I love it. I love it. The way it, like, its whole body moves to that. Oh my god! <laughs> Imagine getting parried like that. Imagine. Clive? Do you feel the heat, brother? It seems like it still has some fire left in it. Yo! Yo! What? What? <laughs> oh, dude, yeah, let me have a moment. Jesus! Oh god, get back. get back, get back. I'm running out of potions, man. I'm running out of potions. This boy's still. Oh! In midair! Let's go! Come on! Come on! Come on, you can't get me! Come on! Come on! <laughs> How are you supposed to? I guess like that. I guess like that. I guess like that. You know? Get back, Clive. Clive! Dude, this is insane! <laughs> One more. No, 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 no. I need Odin! I need Odin! I don't have it! Get in the air! Get in the air! Garuda! Garuda the legend! Garuda the legend! Oh my god! Garuda so OP! Yo! Let's go! Come on! I'm so dead. Torgo, heal me! Torgo, heal me! I do not have enough help! Heal! Torgo, please! Guys, this video game. How is this video game not nominated? I Come on, please. Garuda? No, I was in midair. No, 
Dude, I thought I could live it. I thought I was on the ground. This is the hardest fight. In the, is this the hardest fight in the game? Is this the hardest fight in the game? This is crazy. Come on, come on, come on. We're good. Odin. I'm scared. Chat, I'm scared. I'm scared, bro. Oh my god. Got Odin up a little bit. I freaking love this game, dude. And then, that's crazy. Big damage, chat. Come on. Oh, oh, oh God. Oh. What, what the, what the, what the? What was that? <laughs> Bro, what are you doing? What are you cooking? Chill, chill. Oh, oh my God. Bro. No, please God, please God. Oh God, oh God. Have mercy, have mercy on me, holy hell. <laughs> Jesus, oh my. No, no, no. Clive! Oh! Come on, dude! Back up, back up, back up, back up! We're good, we're good, we're good! Use one more potion! Go, 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 go! No! Ah! Torgal! Fight! Just go! Ravage! Okay, I know. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. No, I missed it again. Hold on. Let's keep. Let's keep our. Keep our. Oh, we don't have the thing on chat. We don't have the revival thing on. Oh God. Oh no. I need my health back. I need my health back. No. Oh. Go.
Heal me! Come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh dear god. Oh dear god. I'm dead. Oh. I can't go on. <laughs> My man jumped up into the air and used his own ignition ability that is far better than mine and crashed back down to the ground and killed me instantly. That's insane. Come on, baby. I'm, I might, I might die. We got it this time, chat. I believe. I believe, chat. This one little spot. Please, this, please. <laughs> that one little spot. That one little spot. Let's go. Oh my God. <laughs> Build up Odin. Oh no. Guys. Yeah! Oh! <laughs> Dude, the secret is as soon as you see it flare in the sky, as soon as you see it flare, it pops a flare and immediately attacks with it as soon as you see it. It's, you don't wait for it to come to you. You, you do it when it's in midair, like at his spot. That's crazy. That's actually crazy. Bro, I am popping off right now. I am absolutely popping off. You are done, bro. I know everything you're gonna do. I know everything you're gonna do. Come on. Let's go! Dude, I'm really... Okay. Come on, come on. Let's go, I did it again! Let's go, <laughs> Bro, there's no way, there's no way, there's no way, there's no way. Oh my God, dude, this fight, this fight, dude. Oh my god. Come on. Odin! Come on. Massive damage. Massive damage. Staggered.
Let's go! Get Odin back again? Phase three. What? What? There's more? Bro. What do you mean by that, Joshua? We better kill it quick. What the? What? Just keep fighting. Huh? The battlefield's smaller. What? What? Am I supposed to stop it? Hold on, hold on chat, hold on, hold on. Am I supposed to stop it? I'm doing this so I can talk to you. Do, am I supposed to stop it? DPS check? Hold on, Odin, 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 Odin. Odin, please, please Odin, please, please Odin. No. Oh my God, oh my God. He's still going. Giga Flare, Giga Flare, please, please. Dude! <laughs> I'm so scared, chat! I'm so scared! What am I supposed to do? But, uh, uh. I'm, I'm spamming! I'm spamming, bro! I'm spamming! I'm spamming! <sighs> ignition! Ignition! I'm literally going to die! I'm going to die! What is happening? Oh! Hold on! Hold on! Hold it again! Hold it again! Hold it again! Hold it again, please! Please! Get to five, get to five, get to five. You don't get to five, Odin. I swear to God. Odin, I swear to God, if you don't get to five. Odin, I'm going to kill you. Odin, why are you, why did you, why did you do this? Hold on, hold on. Okay, okay. Oh, hold on, hold on. Come on, give me enough damage, enough damage, enough damage. Please, please, please. No, it's still not enough, it's still not enough. I know, I know. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, please, please! Oh my god, this is crazy! This is freaking crazy! We almost have it! We almost have it! We almost have it! Mesmerize! Oh my god! Oh my god! Please, please! Heal! 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 Torgo! Heal me! Heal me, Torgo! We got it! Come on! Corona! Corona, please! Slam! Yes! Oh my god! <laughs> bro oh my god dude my neighbors are probably so mad at me dude I was screaming <laughs> dude I was so loud I I, I want to apologize I was so loud, dude. That was crazy. That was like the absolute adrenaline of that moment. Oh my goodness. Dude, I was using like everything. The, the fact that you have to like dodge things while you're fighting and while you're making, sh it's like everything at once. You're dodging. There's really no time to parry because you have to be sitting off attacks and you're constantly like running around trying to get all your abilities back. Dude, if I didn't have Odin, I would have literally died, I think. I think Odin saved me. Because Odin at least does the time stop for those couple of moments where I get a little bit of a breather. I, I'm just going to call it. I think Odin is the GOAT icon in this game for me. Like, multiple times over, Odin has saved me multiple, multiple, multiple times. And I, I just, I can't, even, I can't even think right now. That was incredible.
Omega Control Unit. Offline. Initiating. Emergency core extraction. Do we get Omega powers? Wait, hold up. They wouldn't cook that hard, would they? Would you care to do the honors, Clive? <laughs> Gladly. I just thought about that, Chuck. For what? I thought I told you to leave this place. What must you ruin us all? I, I cannot let you do that. We need these crystals. They're all we have. And just who is this we? We are of an ancient tribe. One of the first to lose its lands to the blight. For countless years, we were forced to roam the twins. A nation without a mother crystal. A people without a blessing. So we found our own. The dust crystals provide us a means to survive. Yes, but at what cost? I call crystals. These shards channel ether. And where do you think that ether comes from? I love, I love it's Clive. from the land. As a leech sucks blood from a beast. And what? You just expect us to believe that? No. But that doesn't make what we've told you any less true. If this heart is anything like the others, it will bleed the twins of their life force. Till naught remains, naught but death. The proof is all around. What do you think robbed your people of their home in the first place? We are trying to stop that from happening again. And this is the only way. Fuck me. You're Sid. <laughs> you saw what happened after the Empire lost Drake's head. <laughs> What do you suppose they will do when they find out, as they surely will, that there is another heart hidden right here under their noses? Your people's need will count for naught. Break it. Break it. Damn it. It doesn't look like we have much of a choice. But you said you didn't believe him, Chief. I don't. But the man does have a point. There's no keeping this place a secret now. And hanging on to these crystals will only get our people killed. It's true. He's doing the smart thing. Have it your way, then. Just promise me you'll leave my people out of it. Stand back. It's about to get hot in here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> all right, all right. Clive about, about to cook. About to cook. Dude, with the buster sword. System overload. Uh, the 
hope we did the right thing. It's so pretty. All of a sudden it's like, all right, now get out of there. You're on a timer. It's a parkour mission. Go. Oh, shoot. I almost just fell on my chair. Oh, my goodness. And the warthog run starts playing. What a game. What a freaking game. Thank you all for the subs. Thank you all for being here. I'm kind of sad that it's over already. I don't want it to be over again. <laughs> I start crying again. Kai, thank you for the tier one. Clayto, thank you for the 41. Thanks, guys. Appreciate you, Clayto. Thank you for the kind message. We all saw the crystals fade, but what of the cages? We barely even explored half of the chambers. Mm, without the heart to sustain them, I doubt those still slumbering in the tower will stir now, if ever. I hope you're right. The last thing the world needs is one of those six-legged pests running around wreaking havoc. We have more than enough two-legged pests to deal with as it is. <laughs> However blameless they may claim to be. What? Oh. <laughs> Two-legged. Right. What? Sorry. I was just wondering what I'm going to tell the village elders when we get back. I suppose I'll just beg them for forgiveness, and when that doesn't work, give them the slip and lie low for a year or two. You're planning to run away. Again. What? It's got us this far, hasn't it? I mean, we may have had a bit of help, like. Kind of you to remember. Will you and your people be all right? Oh, we've made do without before. I reckon we'll survive. And if what you said is true, it's not like the rest of the realm's going to have it much easier. Besides, one man's ordeal is another man's opportunity, as the old saying goes. I don't recall ever hearing that one, but <laughs> fine. No. <laughs> Now, if you don't mind, we've got places to be. We do? I mean, we do. Uh, thanks for <laughs> everything. These guys have no idea what we I did for them. I said, we've got places to be. <laughs> like, you guys would have died so much if, you, if we were not here. <laughs> Back to the hideaway then. Karen and Hippocrates will want to hear about this. Uh, I was thinking we might first return to the tower and see if we can... Back to the hideaway, then. Oh. Jill just said, uh, no, Joshua. Goodbye. Back are ya? So? Did you find out where the dust crystals were coming from, or what? It's, uh, a long story. And perhaps one better told in the shelves. So we explain it to them. Bloody hell. Remind me never to go poking round in any I wonder if they're going to tease ruins. anything. Not only a mother crystal of human creation, but an icon as well. Truly, the study of our fallen forebears is endlessly rewarding. The wonders of which they were capable never ceased to amaze. They came as something of a surprise to us, too. You can say that again. We had no idea what we were getting ourselves into when we set foot in that tower. We only knew the old stories. 
of a people so consumed by greed that they sought to overthrow the gods. The night has it the thing we found in that tower was conceived for that very purpose. Omega, the offspring of the Fallen's boundless knowledge and unchecked ambition. A dangerous combination for all concerned. And Ultima crushed them. It was he whose secrets the Fallen coveted, let's not forget. He whom they strove to dethrone. Just as we strive to dethrone him now. Without their knowledge. And without their weapons of war. It's so weird hearing Clive. them talk about fighting Ultima. We've already done it in my mind in some this ways. This power I've been given may exceed even theirs. But if I use it as they did, who's to say things won't end the same way? Come now, brother. I think the events of recent days have made it abundantly clear that we are not our ancestors. As well you know. You're right. They made crystals. We destroy them. In crafting their artificial heart, the Fallen sought to emulate the Divine. But that is not the path we have chosen. No. We don't want to be gods. We just want to be free. Aww. Well said. If one does not learn from the mistakes of the past, one is doomed to repeat them. And so, I mean to write down everything you've told me to the very last detail. Yay! That those who come after might learn from our travails. And perhaps, just perhaps, forge a brighter future for our descendants. I wonder if that's the book thing. There's still so many theories about that still. Oh, I like that. Echoes of the Fallen quest complete. You guys said to go speak with Black Blackthorn. Trouble with your gear, or so would it be? Oh my lord! What? <laughs> guys, what? I, I'm gonna hide my face cam for a second so you can see the the values on this. Omega weapon. Are you kidding me, guys? A blasphemous coupling of living flesh and synthetic bone, the relic of an age long forgotten, shudders with that self-same vital spirit that animated the Sage Spire's mightiest of sentinels. And when he looked upon mankind's creation, he saw himself. Oh my god. That's sick, dude. Oh, oh, it's purple, my favorite color. Let's go. Oh, that's so clean. That's so freaking clean. Oh, okay. This is definitely what we're going to be using in the, um, in the Leviathan DLC chat. We'll be using Omega weapon. We'll have a purple sword. Man, what a DLC. I loved it. I loved it. It was short and sweet, which I actually think is fine. I actually think it's fine. I, I, I want part two to be a little bit longer. That would be my wish. I, I just I just can't believe we have another boss fight. Another very short and sweet moment in the game of just doing some badass fights. There was multiple mini bosses too that were new, I think. I, I don't, they don't, it doesn't seem like they were anything I fought before. There was a lot of new enemies. Um, it was really cool seeing the prehistoric animals. I thought that was super interesting. Like, we're, you're fight, fighting all these test subjects, and you might be fighting, like, the original chocobos or something. But they've, like, you know, evolved over time to, to real chocobos. But now, in the past, they're, like, raptors or something. That was very cool. I like that. Um, I love the music in this DLC. Um, again, it, it, there was... The main music was like the area that you were in, like the background music of the tower. Um, it had like multiple phases to it. And then there was like the main boss fight music. Um, and it was awesome. Uh, again, didn't didn't expect, you know, crazy amounts of new music or anything. But the boss fight music is one of the best, the best tracks in this entire game. Easily. On the sound side, I'm just so um, happy that 
they won Best Music this year at the Game Awards. Much deserved. I was calling it from the very beginning when I was playing this game. I was like, if this game doesn't win Best Music, man, I don't know. Because this game's music is so good. And such variety as well. Like, that, that song was so different than the other boss fight songs. Like, that was crazy. Um, I loved it. It really hyped me up. It reminded me of, like, again, I, I keep saying it, but this game reminds me so much of, like, supersonic boss fights of my childhood. Like, it just reminds me of, like, yes, we're going, like, light speed, hyper speed. Like, just running everywhere, lightning, attacks, lasers everywhere. Like, just hype you up, right? Like, if I was 14 playing this, I would be having, I mean, I already am having the time of my life, but like, if I just imagine being like a kid, seeing all of these like flashes of light and colors, everything, I'm like, dude, this is the craziest thing I've ever played. It's so cool, man. Again, it just feels like something from my childhood reborn for me. Um, and I think that's why I love this game so much and why it has such a resonance for me is that it, it tickles my brain in just the right way that reminds me of boss fights of my childhood but done like even better you know um and and gameplay from my childhood that feels even better right just like high energy you know amps you up gets gets your heart rate going gets you excited gets you like wanting to drink some water and go like hell yeah i did that like hell yeah it made me feel good um and and i think in general if there's anything about final fantasy 16 that I love the most, I think it's that feeling that it gives. Um, it, it has fantasy in the name, but the power fantasy of this game is one of the best of all time, in my opinion. Again, I, I, I'm not gonna sit here, I'm not gonna like critique every aspect because I, I'm not like a reviewer, right? I'm just, I'm a guy who works in the gaming industry and I love seeing games do really, really cool things. And this game continuously has done really, really cool things and makes me feel so empowered as a player. And that is what I will always remember from this game the most, is just how badass it makes you feel, you know?